All right, so straight up and down, I'm going to just be real with you. This is how things go from bad to worse, right? Your boy gets pulled over by Arkansas State Police for doing 20 miles per hour over the speed limit. Cops are added to with the trooper. Your man's got weed residue on his lap. The trooper sees this, calls his sergeant. Him and his sergeant roll up to the car again, and you already know what happens. Your boy takes off. Three liter inline six hurricane engine Jeep versus two 5.7 liter Hemi Chargers. You already know what happens. I don't even have to tell you. All right. They threw the book at your boy. They did him dirty. 14 charges, two of which were felonies. They did him dirty. But either way, let's get into it. What's up, guys? It's your boy Knockout360 here with another video, man. So you can tell I'm in a house that makes this a house vlog. You know what's going down. Look around. Let's get into it. Car content, car shows, car reviews, car meets, anything and everything car related happens on this channel. So if you're into that, make sure that you stay, stay around because uh, we got some good stuff coming, man. You can tell I messed that last part up, but it doesn't matter. Let's go ahead and get into it, man. All right. Yeah. ASP. Arkansas State Police. <clears throat> Got the Jeep in the left-hand lane. The audio will kick in in a minute. Let me speed it up, actually. All right, so boom. So your boy decides to speed up. He's doing 90 with a trooper behind him. Come on now. Trooper gets on his butt. It's a wrap. Go ahead and pull it over. Boys in Arkansas with South Carolina plates. What's going on? All right, you see you, boy. He didn't even touch the car. Normally, they touch the car. No ID, no nothing. Coming from South Carolina and Arkansas. You don't have anything? Nothing. What? A picture of your driver's license? Will you pull it up for me? Which is not going to bode well for him in the future. Is this your personal vehicle? Is it a rental? Do you have the agreement with you? I can't read that number. You might want to zoom in. I, you might want to say, I can't read that number. I can't read it. Zoom in. I can't hear you either. 446. Four, He's pissing his trooper off. All 
All right, so I'm going to speed it up just a little bit. He calls the sergeant. Kevin stands up and he falls down, but it looks like shakes in his lap. So him and the sergeant. The sergeant not playing no games. He's looking in the back all that. Will you make sure the car will you make sure the cars in park and step out for me, please? Will you make sure the cars in park and step out for me, please? Hey, it might sound like he's asking you, but he's giving you a lot of work. Five sevens going to get a three liter. Let's go. Seven getting up there, 121, 123, 125, 130. On the highway, too. He's stretching that 5'7 all the way out. Is that him? That's your boy right there in the three liter. Hurricane engine. <laughs> That's the future of Dodge right there. I can already tell this isn't going to go well for the boy in the Jeep. Like the officer's slowing down just to stay with them. Look at that, losing control, hits the semi, side swipes the semi. They got to take him out, man. They got to take your boy out. He's on him. He's going in for the pit. Here it comes. At 150, 115? Wow. A pit maneuver at 115. Roll over 16, please. Look at your boy flipping. Hold on, let's go back. You can see him flipping. Look at him flipping. Yep. Do not rush the vehicle. This is the sergeant now, I believe. This is the sergeant. All right, running. get on the ground. He's running on foot. Suspect was later arrested at a truck stop after his wife called police to turn him in. His wife turned him in. His wife called the police and turned him in. Look what they charged the boy with. Charging him with fleeing in the vehicle, fleeing on foot, speeding, reckless driving, possession, controlled substance, possession, drug paraphernalia, criminal mischief, leaving scene of an accident, no license, no seatbelt, obstructing, no insurance, no registration, unauthorized use of property. Damn. That's literally everything that you could charge somebody with in this situation. So let's look at the Jeep. After the Jeep was... Uh, 
Oh wow, yes, yeah, it's, it's total. Yeah, that end line is gone. That hurricane is gone. Axle, uh, the wheel, everything's gone. Yeah. Oh, they did them dirty. And look, this is all the damage that happened to the five seven. This little bit right here, nothing. But they charged them with that. They charged them with damage. Got it. I mean, come on now. Come on. Yeah, like I said, speeding, obstructing governmental operations, reckless driving, fleeing vehicle or conveyance, exceeding the speed limit, fleeing on foot, possession of a controlled substance, four ounces or more, uh, possession of drug paraphernalia, failure to present proof of insurance, failure to, pre uh, to display vehicle registration, leaving a scene involving property damage only, criminal mischief, second degree, $5,000. So I'm assuming that was because of the... Uh, um, hitting the side swipe in the semi, uh, failure to present driver's license, no seat belt property. Man, this guy's making South Carolina look bad. I hope that this was just a rental car. Although most rental cars that I've seen are, uh, you'll see Florida plates. I've never seen a South Carolina rental car, uh, South Carolina tag on a rental car, but no driver's license, no registration, no insurance, li South Carolina license plates, but you're in Arkansas. You got weed on your lap. They said they found a gun, but that apparently was registered to him, so it wasn't illegal or anything. And you decide to take off on troopers. And you make the situation worse because you already blew up the scene from the beginning because you forced the trooper to call for backup and he, or call for a sergeant, which is essentially backup. So now you got two troopers that's already chasing you. You're driving an inline six uh, hurricane engine in a Jeep versus two five seven Hemis. This guy deserved it, man. Straight up and down. Like, this is good police work. This is tactical vehicle intervention, TVI. So it's either pit or TVI. They call it TVI, tactical vehicle intervention. At 115, they pitted you, they, they TVI'd your boy at 115 in a Jeep and flipped him. Like I said, some departments, like I said, uh, above a certain limit. Oh, a bur above a certain speed limit, some departments, you know, they can't pit maneuver you or they choose not to. Um, or it probably has to be authorized. Like I told you, in North Carolina, um, to my understanding, anything above 40, 50 miles per hour, they can't pit maneuver you. I could be mistaken. Um, in extenuating circumstances, I'm sure that they could if they got the authorization to do so. But at 115, like... Only certain departments, I would imagine, can do that. And uh, Arkansas uh, seems to be one of those departments. <laughs> Pit maneuvering you at 115, it's a wrap. Your car is done. Your car is done. And they said his wife called in to turn him in later on that night. Wow. Wow. Weed on your lap, gun in the car, weed paraphernalia, and you decide to take off. No license, no registration, no insurance from South Carolina in Arkansas. You deserve it, man. That's that's being stupid right there. You deserve it. You know, whatever this guy got, he deserved every bit of it, man. This is good police work. You know, I'm glad nobody was injured. Glad nobody was hurt. But uh, this is good cop work right here. But at least you get to see what a three liter hurricane engine looks like stacked up against a 5.7 liter. Now, mind you, this is not the high output three liter hurricane engine. Um, so, you know, this isn't the, what is it, the, the Ram RHO? The Ram RHO has the high output uh, hurricane engine. And I think that's putting down like 524 horsepower. This right here, I think it's putting like two or 300, you know. But um, Hurricane versus Hemi, Hemi won. So, yeah, um, this guy got what he deserved, man. I got no problems with this. Shout out to the Arkansas State Police Department, you know. They did what they're supposed to do. As always, guys, like, subscribe, comment. It's been your boy, Knockout360, man. I'm going to get out of here. Peace.